Away from security, we move now to education, where we understand the Academic Staff Union of Universities have said they are tired of being dribbled by the federal government's consistent failure to honor agreements reached with the union. The Union of Intellectuals stated that the plan of the federal government to use hunger by withholding salaries of lecturers as a weapon to weaken its agitation and demands will not work. Asu stated that Nigerian university lecturers earn the least salaries when compared with chief lecturers in some tertiary institutions who are not required to supervise postgraduate students or conduct research, earn more than professors in a very lopsided education system. Asu is on strike because of the survival of the university system, where many of us have our children as students. Since we cannot afford sponsoring our children abroad, with our measly salary as politicians do. Also, it's on strike in order to restore the post glory of public universities and address infrastructural decay and deficit in our institutions. Describing the ongoing disagreement on the Integrated Payroll and Personal Information System, IPs, as a distraction to the demands of the union. Adejumo noted that apart from the IPs being a cesspool of corruption, it is strange that the government would lump the payment of lecturers together with that of civil servants. As such, it's not done anywhere in the world. We are ready to suspend the strike as our children too are tired of staying at home. But we cannot continue to work on empty stomach while politicians' homes and, homes and warehouses are filled with palliative materials that they don't even need. Let the politicians note that the interest of Nigerians and the future generation is more paramount to ASU than the immediate gains of its members. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.